is about the rate of chemical reactions. There are many factors which increase or decrease the speed or rate of a chemical reaction. Watch the next clip and note down the factors that increase the speed of burning. Fires need oxygen. The more oxygen, the faster they burn. With liquid oxygen, they burn faster still. This biscuit is soaked in liquid oxygen. A piece of wood burns so well when it's soaked in liquid oxygen that it even burns under water. But what happens if you can't increase the amount of oxygen? Aluminium foil won't burn, but if you grind it into a fine powder and blow it into a flame, it will. Lumpy custard? Powdered custard? Most substances, like hydrogen in this jar, need a flame to burn. Or do they? This is platinum, used as a catalyst. This can is filled with natural gas. As the gas burns off the top, it's replaced by air coming in through the bottom, which mixes with the rest of the gas. The ways shown in the clip to speed up burning were to increase the amount of oxygen getting to the fuel, or to increase the surface area of the fuel by breaking it into smaller pieces or a fine powder, or to add a catalyst like platinum. Another way of speeding up a chemical reaction is to increase the temperature. Rates of reaction can be explained using the collision theory. Particles of the reacting substances must collide before a reaction can take place. The more collisions, the faster the reaction. Here's a question about the collision theory. How can the four ways of speeding up a combustion reaction be explained by using the collision theory? A higher concentration of reactants, fuel or oxygen, means that there are more particles involved, so there's more chance of them colliding and reacting. A larger surface area of fuel means more particles are exposed to oxygen, so there's more chance of them colliding and reacting. A higher temperature excites particles into moving more quickly, so there's more chance of them colliding and reacting. Adding a catalyst lowers the amount of energy needed for colliding particles to successfully react. That's it for Rates of Reactions.